Boom Supersonic, the company behind what is touted to be the next supersonic passenger aircraft, Overture, has finally secured an engine maker to deliver the power plants for its jet. In fact, it has secured three, although none are well known in the commercial aviation space. Announced on December 13th at its Greenboro site, Boom revealed plans to work with Florida Turbine Technologies, Standard Aero, and GE Additive, a unit of GE Aerospace. The engine being developed had been dubbed the Symphony and is described by the company as a new propulsion system designed and optimized for the overture. Blake Scholl, founder and CEO of Boom, commented on the partnership, saying, Developing a supersonic engine specifically for Overture offers by far the best value proposition for our customers. Through the Symphony program, we can provide our customers with an economically and environmentally sustainable supersonic airplane, a combination unattainable with the current constraints of derivative engines and industry norms. Boom had faced being shot out by many of the world's largest engine makers, with the likes of Pratt & Whitney, Rolls-Royce, GE Aviation, Honeywell and Safran all publicly stating they had no interest in developing engines for the jet. Nevertheless, Boom maintained it would find and announce an engine maker before the end of 2022. From Boom's information, the engine will feature a twin-spool architecture and be a medium bypass turbofan engine with no afterburner. It'll have a thrust of 35,000 pounds at takeoff. Original concept designs of the Overture pegged it as a twin jet. Later, it became a trijet. But the most recent and final iteration of the design has the aircraft as a quad jet. We selected a four engine configuration after extensive R&D and efforts to understand the supply chain capabilities of our partners. Using four engines lets us shrink the size of each engine allowing production to fall within current supply chain and manufacturing capabilities, all while reducing the noise levels of the aircraft. Boom's statement goes on, saying, The use of four engines instead of three also keeps weight and temperature within existing technology constraints, while allowing Overture to work within established supply chain and maintenance norms. With engine makers in place, the race is on to develop and test the propulsion technology in time for Boom's goal of starting manufacturing in 2024. That's not long to create a complete engine and test it to the extent that it could be installed on a flying overture. Boom wants to roll out the first overture in 2026, with a view to beginning its test flight campaign in 2027. That's a quiet pushback of the deadline, which was stated at Farnborough Air Show to be 2025 and 2026, respectively. Both the aircraft and the engine will need to be certified before either can enter into service, although the firm could begin flight testing with an uncertified engine as an experimental aircraft. What do you think of this latest news? Share your thoughts by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.